Okay, here you go. I am jelly doing jelly prints with uh, with a Josie, and we are using some of our paints and things that we haven't used. Now I'm using, let's see, these guys. I've got them for so long. I guess it's I didn't even realize they were Dale Rowney. I bought these at um, in North Carolina at some kind of art show. I can't even remember, but. Um, that's what I'm doing. Behind it is uh, just some paper. So you, that's what you see, some contact paper. But otherwise, and so we are do using some fall colors, and the both of us are making. I'll show you what we what we make. Unfortunately, we're skyping, and I can't use my webcam at the same time, so I can't record the whole thing. Unfortunately, so I'm just going to do a little bit here and there because I don't think my phone has enough. Uh, memory on it to unless I delete a whole bunch of stuff to do a recording that's right okay this I just put some a bunch of um, stencils down and I put green and I put orange and I put gold so let's see how this all comes out and Josie's doing hers and she'll have some pictures of hers too yeah they're you know and it's, and it's true they say you guys are getting older why build a two-story house there's Josie. Okay, so now this, these are the ones I just did. So they've got that, that orange and some of that green, and they're just hanging here. I wish I had some place. My studio is still a mess. I am reorganizing everything and labeling everything, so it's going to take me a while. But this looks really cool. So let's see how this one comes out. Okay, so that's what I did. I put that stencil down, and look how pretty, I think if you can see it, it came out really beautiful. And I used the gold elegant finish by, uh, is it Deco, that one's Deco Art. And then, you know, the drop, the, these guys, which I want to use. My granddaughter loves them. My granddaughter, Mackenzie. I've got them for years, and she was the only one that really used them. But look how nice, that came out like a frame around... I really love that. I don't know if I could even even, even want to do another coat on that because that looks really pretty just the way it is. Okay, guys. I've got like them everywhere. That's the only thing. I don't have any place to really hang them. So I'm just kind of... Look at that. How pretty. Huh? I'm just using um, golds and, you know, some yellow and um, look at that. That pretty colors. So some of these I'm going to make envelopes out of, and then some of these uh, I need to do some other crafts with, and some beads, because they work really nice if you want to make those paper beads with them. That really, I love the beads that came out with the uh, deli paper, the deli sheets. Oh, it's just beautiful. So that's what we're doing, and oh, what's this one? Oh, you know what? i got to detach some of these. That get, oh, look at this one. Look at this one. Isn't that cool? And here's one here. Not really set up, but, you know, I wanted to do it. Look at that gold. Isn't that cool? Okay. I made a mess, so I'm going to keep making a mess. Okay. So here are some. This one, I don't know if you can see this, but I embossed. I actually used the the uh, gold um, deco art, that stuff, with this uh, stamp, which I'm trying to clean. This stamp. And then I embossed with embossing powder. And the heat gun, of course, and it came out really nice. I didn't even know you could use paint actually, but um, it came out really nice. See that? That beautiful. So that's that's one. And then this one, I just stamped it in. I put some black ink on it. And that's cool. And this, I haven't done anything else to it. It's got. I don't know if you can see these pretty hearts in there. Really pretty. So that that I like. And this one, I'm going to probably do some stamping or something over it. I'll just use it the way it is as a background and then paint over it with something. There's those the hearts again. So these are just my little stencils. And then, um, you know, then here's the deli paper, which I got to say, I love making the beads out of the deli paper. They're, they're beautiful. 
So I will be making beads out of the deli paper and then actually probably making backgrounds for pictures and uh, some envelopes with the actual copy paper that I colored. So isn't that cool? Here's another one. I've got some different colors on this and some copper metallic and gold and teal and of course pink. So we'll see how these come out, but that looks kind of cool, huh? So let's see what we can turn that into. This is this is it mushed. How cool. And there's there's Josie. She's really there. We're doing it together. <laughs> Say hi. Show some of yours. Um let's see here. Here's one of them. Like I'll show them in a video. Can you see that good? Yeah. Josie's gonna do a video too. Oh look at that. Yes. I like all those designs. She's got really cool stuff to make um uh, what was I going to say? To make texture. That's it. To make the print. Here's another one. Oh, look. Oh, that's beautiful. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, and that, and you're... The, the, um, the wood... The wood block. Oh, the wood block. I love... Oh, look at that. How that's cool. Pretty. Yes. Yeah. Absolutely beautiful. This is another one done by the oh, wood block. Let me see. Oh, <gasps> I got to get those wood blocks. Where did you say you got them? He's in England. Oh, they're in England? Well, thank you so much for being here. I hope you enjoyed this. I wish I could have taped it better, but I couldn't use my webcam and Skype um, at the same time, unfortunately. I can do that with Zoom, but you can't do it with Skype. So not that I know of. So if any of you know how to do it, that'd be great. But I wanted to just give you a little glimpse. And Josie will be putting up a video also. I'll put her link below. And I just hope you enjoy this. It's just fun to watch people do jelly prints or, or see the outcome at least. So I had a blast. Over five hours we played together on Skype. It was a blast. So you know what, guys? You all should try it. If you haven't already, try it. And please don't forget to give me a thumbs up and subscribe. And the little subscribe button is in the bottom right-hand corner of the video. If you just hit that, it'll take you over and you can subscribe. And I appreciate it. Please share our videos. It helps us and we appreciate it really a lot. And I love you guys and thank you so much for being here. And until the next time, bye-bye.